Hello friends, this is Mohammed Shakil here from How Engineers Do It and in this video I want to show you something which was asked by one of my subscribers that is how to create two equal length lines. So to do that we have to first go to the part design workbench. So let's go to the start, file new, part. Once we have this uh, enter the part name you can enter whatever you want and click on OK. And once we have this part design workbench loaded here you can go to the sketcher and invoke any of the planes so you can start the sketch. So this can be explained only in the sketcher workbench because uh, creating lines, equal length lines and all comes in the sketcher workbench. So to do that, let's first uh, create a line and create another line here. So let's dimension both of these lines let's give it as a 150 and dimension this as well and double click on it and go for edit formula and click here and click on this dimension and click on OK now what happens here is you'll get back to the constraint st uh, window and here you have this 150 mm and it's frozen and uh, we have an extra FX the FX means that it's driven by the formula now. Now let's try changing this by giving 200. I can see that the same thing happens here. And you can give n number of uh, lines. Or maybe you can even, for example, you can create a line. And you can just say that it should be the double of edit formula. And here you can give 2 multiplied by let's click on this dimension here click on OK and it's 400 and click on OK and now if you just try giving 250 then this will be 500 and this will be 250 so all these uh, dimensions are actually driven by the dimension over here so this was asked by one of my subscribers I hope uh, his doubt is cleared now and uh, you guys can also ask any kind of uh, uh, custom tutorials you can request on my uh, my mail or on the comment section I'll, I'll get back to you as I get the time so I hope you enjoyed and uh, also go through my uh, playlist because I've recently updated everything and thank you so much and stay tuned